They know what abuse is. They know what trauma is. They know what it is to struggle with identity. They know what it is to face conflict in their lives. They know what it is to struggle with bitterness and unforgiveness. And Joyce's story and her experience is so particularly relevant to them because they understand that, hey, this lady knows my context. I, I, I might not be able to speak her language. I might not be able to understand her country or her, her culture, but she knows my language of pain and abuse and hurt. And her testimony in their lives gives them hope for their own lives. If, if it can happen for that lady, it could happen for me. Being committed. Being committed is very important. Mobile phones being used by almost everyone on the continent. In fact, there are more mobile phones on the continent of Africa than there are people at the moment. Uh, so this is a really exciting platform and people are accessing the internet well over 85% of people uh, through their mobile phones first. So we've got several pages recently that have been opened up in Nigeria, uh, several that have been opened up in Ethiopia, several in uh, uh, Kenya as well, and we're getting exciting responses from that. So it's one way that we can communicate directly to people uh, on a regular basis, but at the same time where there are physical needs, we respond particularly to those through feeding programs and water wells and anti-human trafficking world work and skills development programs for young girls that prevent them from being sold into child marriage and secure their education for the rest of high school. I think for me, the thing that really touches my heart is in the midst of all the numbers, because we do, we work with some uh, crazy numbers and I think we get blown away uh, listening to some of the reach of people. Um, I mean, you know, the millions and the thousands and the hundreds of thousands, those figures that come back. Uh, what always catches me off guard a little bit and gets me uh, overwhelmed is when you have those one-on-one -on -one encounters with people and each and every one of them has a unique story, each and every one of them uh, has a unique uh, set of challenges that they've got to overcome, a unique set of pain. Uh, but God's particular love for each individual in each country, in each culture, in each language is what blows me away. Thank you.